Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to my channel, my dear friends. My name is Avilash and I'm your trader next to. In this video, I'll be analyzing the chart of ORCAD, Australian dollar, Canadian dollar for 6 April 2021. So this analysis is for 6 April only. You'll see me tomorrow again with the analysis for 7th April. I bring videos on daily basis and in advance so that you do not make any silly mistake and you get to stay ahead of the market. So please do subscribe to my YouTube channel for regular market analysis. And do check out the Forex analysis playlist for the analysis of other currency pairs. So let's get started. So this is the chart of ORCAD. As we all know for the last couple of weeks, this pair is in downtrend. And to be very honest, uh, this pair has given us a plenty of opportunities to make money and we have grabbed those opportunities. And right now, the pair is just at the resistance again at the sweet spot if we just look at the chart then then it is very clearly visible to us that again it is just standing at the sweet spot to make some money but things are a little bit different than the previous weeks okay so i would like to show you here as we all know uh the market is in downtrend and 50 moving average was acting as a resistance and still actually still 50 moving average is acting as a resistance for the market okay and this is the fifth or the sixth touch okay fifth or sixth touch where market is getting this resistance and it is coming down so it was very easy for us to make money here <laughs> so this is the overall chart of hot care and you can see that here 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 and right now market is here so from from this position it was very clear to us okay from this particular position it was very clear to us that yes 50 moving average is a valid resistance for the market and on every rise we got good opportunity to make money and if you watch my videos then hopefully you have already made a couple of bucks okay but right now i would like to take you to the weekly time frame on the weekly time frame you can see that <clears throat> market has just opened above the support and support is the 50 moving average okay so 50 moving average is is support because you can see that for the past two weeks previous week and week and the week before that we can see that market went down okay market went down but market took support at the 50 moving average just look at these two candles market took support at the 50 moving average and it went up so this is a clear indication that 50 moving average is a valid support okay it is resistance in the four hours time frame but right now we are in the weekly time frame and as we all know higher time frames are the time frames of the big players so we must respect the higher time frame so as you can see right here that 50 moving average is a valid support in the weekly time frame therefore therefore uh, we must be very careful right now and as we can see that market is just trading a little above the 50 moving average okay so it is very or it will be very difficult or risky for us to short the market right now okay we must be very careful because 50 moving average is acting as a support in the weekly time frame and here 50 moving average is acting as a resistance in the 4 hour time frame. So, what we should do then? Okay. Considering the overall fact, okay, considering the overall fact that market is in downtrend, okay, and 50 moving average is a valid resistance in the 4 hour time frame, okay, just wait for the market to cross this line or cross this previous candles, 2 3 candles. Once you see the market has crossed this level. Okay, market has crossed this level. Just check the volume. If you see that market has the support of volume and the candle is also good enough, convincing enough, okay, you can short the market. But do remember, market has support in the weekly time frame. Okay, so you need to come out by this level 0 0.9500. Okay, if you short the market below this level, okay, you just need to come out by. 0 0.9500 this is your target this is your target and market is already in the overbought zone so there is a chance that you will get to short the market again but this time <coughs> the target will not be much target is smaller in comparison 
to the previous weeks because market has got support now and on the other hand and on the other hand if market crosses uh, the 50 moving average and starts trading above the 50 moving average then <clears throat> then you just wait you just wait for one day okay, you do not need to trade on the for one day because see market is in downtrend market is in downtrend for last uh, for last one and a half month okay more than one month market is in downtrend so let the market uh, if market wants to go up then let the market um have its setup let the market settle down let the bulls take the charts and at least warm up a bit then we should you know, go for the entry okay therefore as of now what you should do then just observe the price and see how the price reacts okay if market crosses this level and just check the price if you see that yes candles and can the health of the candle is good enough <laughs> huh. uh, sellers are there in the market then you just short the market below this level this will be your target 0 0.9500 in case it crosses the level and starts trading above the 50 moving average just wait for one day market market isn't downtrend for a long period of time let the market rest a bit let the bulls come and warm up a bit then we should look for an entry position i'll come back tomorrow again and i'll tell you what you need to do okay so this is it hopefully you have got the picture of uh odd cat and what you need to do and what you do not what you don't need to do not care so this is it thank you so much see you tomorrow again bye bye take care all the best and if you have not subscribed to my channel please do subscribe bye bye take care